Let's play some Spooder Man. It's time for Spooder Man. Sputter. Sputtery. Great. Love loading screens. What a great time to start. Keep with the mouse cursor. Oh shit. I've waited a long time for this Osborne. Tonight, your criminal empire ends. Dun dun dun. Yeah, dun dun dun. So any minute now. Where's um <laughs> You can like kinda hear the music a little bit. Yeah. The game probably just crashed. Cool. <laughs> so this is great. Uh here. Let's uh before the level even really started. <laughs> Amazing. All right, give me one second. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We got this. <laughs> what a good, what a good thing. Just, just what a, <laughs> what right, a, right. what a great overall thing that happened currently. <laughs> Apparently, his Colonel Empire ended by the game crashing. That's all it took. Screen share with you again. There we go. You can see the spooters. Yep. Okay. Ideally, this time I'll just hit the like the start button and skip the cutscene. So. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Get rid of the. Oh no! Hang on. What's happened? There we go. I fixed it. What happened? Uh, on the uh, on the stream, it was a little goofy looking because uh, it I had to close the game out again. Ah. Uh. Or okay. All right, so welcome to the stream, everyone. Yeah, hi, hello, welcome. What's up? We definitely did not just waste five minutes. Welcome. There we go. Look around. Know where you are. Uh, <laughs> DC Comics. This. Oh no. Unfortunate tendency? That's the that doesn't exist. That's not a thing. Wait, I thought the I thought the fragment turned him into goblin. Or was he already goblin? So no our goblin was already like kind of a goblin? Like, I'll, I'm gonna DM you a picture 
of what he looked like in the comics. So, like, he already had, like, a scaly goblin face. Oh. Oh. Um, Please, Internet. Please. You can't catch me. <laughs> I'm riding on the carnival ride. Oh no, it's not what I wanted. There we go. Can you still hear me? Yeah, I can still hear you. What's up? All right. Just making sure. So I lost. I've been disguised, so I can't see the screen. Oh, well. Stream, whatever. That's fine. Hang on. Oh. All right. There, there is that. Go. Is that better? Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, I don't remember any of the controls, so. <laughs> Great place to learn it. <laughs> So I'll also warn you this level, like... My god, I forget there. about that every time! I'm sorry, I just, I, for, I forget <laughs> about how visceral it is every single fucking time, and it's never not funny. Anyway, you were saying? Uh, you need to be wary of the fireworks going off, because they'll light up the area. And you need to be wary of where they're lighting things up, so you're not seen because of it. Okay. So like normally, Norgolin is like he puts on like a skin mask, kind of like the Red Skull in the first Captain America movie, to hide how he actually looks. But otherwise, he's like normal proportion. I think he, he probably has like super strength or whatever. Yeah. But the fragment turned him into like an actual monster. Oh, Grinch. Which is kind of. Like Ultra Goblin or the giant uh, demonic creature. Oh my god, I did so much damage. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good on that guy. <laughs> I told you not to let him get you. <laughs> I just realized who's voicing Osborne, and now it's funny because I can only hear Pete from like Disney. From what? Uh, Pete. Uh, Mickey's, like, rival character. Oh. Yeah, he's voiced by Jim Cummings. Yeah, that's the name. Who also voiced Craven at the start of the game. Jesus fuck Christ. This level sucks. Look at this shit. Like, <laughs> it was bright as hell. Yeah. So I'll let you know some of the challenges you can do here, but they're really hard to do. You might want to know anyway. Yeah, I, th I think I'm just gonna, like, play the game. That's fair. Like, one of them is perform all six types of takedowns, which can be really awkward to do. Yeah, I'm good on uh, that. Perform five takedowns to stay on higher ground. Uh, take down ten in a row without raising any alarm. It's so unnecessary to punch him. Yeah. <laughs> I'll just remind you of the combat ones, because the cell phones are... can be really annoying. Yeah. Just to remember what it means. Place here. There are people in danger all over the place here. I hear you. On my... <laughs> we got it. On, on your what? What do you hear me on? I don't know. <laughs> I'm never gonna find out. Oh, come on now. You're the best. Shut your mouth. Careful. Uh, apparently you can't go on those roofs, which is nope. extremely fucking stupid. Spider guy. Oh, no. spider guy. That's not my name. Spider man. It's like when Nintendo had that ad campaign, like, don't call it Nintendo. It's, it's like, uh, basically, 
how it works is if your name becomes synonymous with like a a product of some kind, then you could lose the trademark to it. So Nintendo put out an ad campaign to try and teach parents not to call every video game system a Nintendo. Because they're not all Nintendo. <laughs> I don't know that helps that much. So I remember even when I was high school and like, I was in some tech class and my teacher was talking about game systems at one point and they, he referred to them as, like, as selling them as Nintendo. <laughs> Bad teacher. <laughs> God, these fireworks suck! Yep. So you can't go on top of those castle things, by the way. It's like, the game stops you from doing that, which is incredibly bad. <laughs> um, yeah, it's a weird way of making, like, a level border. So uh, buildings you can't do anything with. There we go. It just makes my life a lot easier when I don't have to deal with guys. Yeah. Ice cold drinks! Sweet. Mm -hmm. Oh, go over. I have to tell you, this guy go over to the right border wall. Over there? Yeah, like where it's dark. Oh my god! <laughs> oh! Spooter! Oh, hey. Yep. Alright, so I'm That's over here. Go over to those posters in front of you. I only know this is my last. Playthrough, but these are like references to other characters. Like Fattest Man is probably Kingpin. Uh, oh. Incredible Fish Girl. Uh, not sure what that one is. World's Smallest Leg is probably Wasp. Man of Rubber for Mr. Fantastic. Yeah, those are all like cute little references. Yeah. So in this world, there are like freak attractions or something. Turn around, you son of a bitch. Gotta save those people. There's also enemies above you. Too busy ruining this guy's life. Oh my... Oh my fucking god, what was that? <laughs> I love you for God. Who they are. <laughs> this is very fun. <laughs> Like, as a reminder of how brutal he is, he, in the comics, he killed the vulture by riddling it with bullets from a gun. By what? Shooting him with a gun. A lot. Oh. A lot. <laughs> it wasn't just once or twice, it was a lot. Yeah. Like, he made fucking sure he was dead. And it was only after that, that where he was like, huh, maybe I shouldn't kill him. Use a gun. Oh, God damn it. See, this level's not very big. It's just what? What are you? Who are you talking to? There's no one here. Oh. It's like if he heard when civilians cry for help, but they didn't say anything. I hear you. On my way. <laughs> I hear you. On my way, he says before brutally beating the shit out of somebody. Yeah. Oh my god! 
god, Spider-Man, it's so not necessary. With how brutal you are, it's not, it's just not required. How do you mean? I think it's completely necessary. Look at that. Like, that was like a normal takedown. Like, you wrap him up and now he falls on the ground. That's it, right? Yeah, there was... That, it was... It was expect him the game. Yeah, but in this game, he's just like, also sometimes I just need to break eight ribs to do it. <laughs> and their jawline, maybe. Oh, sorry. Someone was messaging me. Uh, okay, cool. Sorry about that. Making sure we're we're all good there. Okay. But yeah, like Spider Man, you don't need to break six ribs and a fucking jawline just to put him to sleep. It's okay. Remember I saw like a, a family where they were suggesting how there's like some similarities between Spider Man Noir and Batman with how like this takes place in nineteen thirties and Batman was afraid in the thirties. Uh he's a little darker, he operates at night. He used the gun to start his career. I wonder I wonder if that was like the inspiration. Have they ever talked about where like can like in our in in real life, have they talked about where Spider Noir was kind of like birthed from, or? I'm not sure. You're the best. Yep. Also, because also the the comics are very much a Noir comic. Yeah. Few left. Oh, there's a golden spire on the wall there. God, I don't get it. I just don't understand why he has to hurt them so much. It's just so not necessary. I love it. Though. I love how through this person. Yeah, it's very funny. <laughs> it's it's very entertaining. I love it. Cause like there, there will never be a situation where he would need to ruin these guys' lives like he does. Yeah, like they'll never, they'll never see like a version of him in the MCU or the Sonic game where he's this brutal. Yeah, he it's will literally game. never be like this outside of like this. <laughs> or certain comic instances. Oh fuck you! You did not see me. All right. Also wearing a black suit too, but yeah. Come on, the guard, the guards sometimes have like perfect, perfect eyesight. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> it's so annoying. On the plus side, this is the last twenty nine nine level. <laughs> What? I saw on the plus side is the last twenty nine uh for the noir level. Okay, I was like, I was like, wait a minute, this is the twenty ninety nine? I've been confused this whole time. <laughs> my god, my, oh my god, my thing is mixed up. Oh, come on! Just check out the archer guys first. Part of my great responsibility is getting folks out of jams. Wait. Two-headed cow? Two cow? You can't just leave me here. You can't! Time for a lie down. Time for a lie down. This whistling is driving me fucking nuts. <laughs> From above. Oh, 
Oh my god! <laughs> you were almost close on me. I'm gonna do the, the up close put down. Alright. This is the last guy. I'm turning off this fucking spider sense. I hate it. <laughs> this whole level sucks. It's way too bright. Uh, Spider-Man. Spider-Man. Put it, go on the ground. Go on the ground, bud. How about an next Is that a Hihachi clown? <laughs> it looks like him, right? Like, kind of. Like it's the hair. It's definitely the hair. It looks like Hihachi. I do love the messed up, like, Sinister Karma music. E. You make it sound so Ow! The goblin in all his glory. Stronger. More powerful. And that hair, it's scarier than ever. God damn it. Oh! Ow! Oh, ow. Ugh. Hello, Lenny6222. Uh, <laughs> they just say Zendaya. Hell yeah. I'm beating you. you could beat me. What? <laughs> what? What are you doing? If you can, come and get your superior, the Goblin Victorious. His name is Victorious, like the Nickelodeon show. <laughs> I'm glad he has a giant fuck me light on his back. I'm so glad you gave it the proper name. <laughs> uh, it bull. Hello, bull. Seems the goblin victorious forgot to pay his electric bill. Har har. Why'd you go for the ball? Okay. So the challenge to use the ball to knock down fire slugs, aka pick up and throw it on fire time. Yo, game smart. Hello. It's uh, Hello. if I recall, that's Neil. Nice. Oh my God, where's the ball? What ball? Come back, ball. You might want to use the spire sense to find it easier. Oh, I can actually see now. Oh, there's the ball. Yeah. Oh, you mean to do that? Yeah. Okay, just do it four more times. Damn it! Just let me pick up the fucking ball! <laughs> Get balled! <laughs> I'm going to ruin your fucking life. <laughs> oh my god, Jess. Thank you. Thank you. Wait, what's the lock on button? Alright, I got him. I got him now. So there's also a challenge to push back fire clone to the single spider stop. I don't remember how you do that move. Neither do I. And some in the air. Ah. Oh, how is the uh the Overwatch beta? 
I haven't heard like anyone talk about it really, so. <laughs> Let me teach you. What? He like gra that just didn't do anything. <laughs> There we go. God damn it. Fight this time. I like that. Why'd you show up just to like let me pummel you and then you ran away anyway? <laughs> just yeah. just go away or kill me. Don't worry about it. Oh look, another Hayahachi door. <laughs> like I'm dead serious. Look up a picture of him. It's literally the same person. With a but with clown makeup and he's a door. <laughs> and he's a door. There's a difference. <laughs> Homecoming in the chat. This stream's nice and all, but did you get <laughs> me pictures of dead Spider-Man? <laughs> oh my god, yeah, that really is. It looks a lot like his hair. <laughs> yeah, I told you. I wasn't. I wasn't he's fucking. Yo. Oh, they can just. Get me out. I already let you out. Um. Oh, apparently, like, Overwatch Two had 1.4 million viewers. That's crazy. Like I said, I I didn't know. I didn't even know the beta was going on. I mean, to be fair, most of that is probably like. Fans of the series already. <laughs> Can yeah, you... and people, people in my front group either don't care about the game already or don't want to talk about it for obvious reasons. Yeah. Keep an eye on it. Oh, you know what? Fuck this guy. He sucks. I'm out. <laughs> Fuck this shit. I'm out. <laughs> Homecoming says, I'm, I'm sure he's tired of my bullshit, but it'd be a nice afternoon to be- What?! What? I have- I have several questions. And- And they're all BS. Oh, apparently there was a spider up here. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Okay, the, the the invisible walls are driving me fucking bonkers right now. I'm playing as Night Monkey. <laughs> it is like that. Two in front of home was. I wonder if that was meant as like an illusion to this too. And some for you. God damn it. Okay. Well, that happened. Okay, great. Oh, me in the face. I have this on the Wii, hoping they put this on Xbox backwards compatibility. Uh, they won't, because they closed the backwards compatibility program. And there was a. Uh... What? Come on. <laughs> um. I don't remember how long this was, but apparently there was going to be remasters of this game and the sequel at one point. Um, and the only reason it didn't happen is because Activision started getting a little greedy with the Marvel license and started to push for doing new games with the license. So Marvel, so Marvel said, fuck you, you're not doing anything. Oh, jeez. Yeah, it really sucks. I want these games to be on modern platform. I'm trying to work in like really basic remaster, just like a visual upgrade. But 
Yeah, just, just kind of clean it up and make sure they run. Yeah. There might have also been other shadows. I know for sure there's one in the It's like... You I really wish they weren't locked to pieces of this. Yeah, it'd be nice. I say as I try my best to emulate the PS3 version because it's just not available anymore. Yeah, because also they were all taken off their system store. Yeah, another licensing thing. Probably. Uh, yeah, the Avengers are in bad hands with Square, and the Guardians are okay, and Insomniac is good. <laughs> yeah, I mean the Guardians game was amazing. That and Spider-Man are doing great. But... Just wait for to get... These older Activision published Spider-Man games brought back. They're not talking about as much site. Actually, they ought to be. What? Let me take them down! What are you doing? <laughs> I'm hitting circle! No, it's not close enough. Don't give me a targeting reticle if I... Fuck you! Fuck that guy! He sucks! Oh my god. Oh! Homecoming, thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. But do you feel like Spider-Man? Mm, I would... I would say no. Overall, no. <laughs> I do not feel like a man of the spiders. Do you feel like 1930 I'm gonna be the shit out of people with Spider-Man? <laughs> Maybe. I should probably mention I don't think you need to take out every single enemy in this area. You just need to do it enough so you can rescue the, the workers. Uh, excuse me? <laughs> I'll just wait here. Uh, yeah, I'll let that help you. <laughs> IGN disliked that comment. Is IGN like weirdly hype on this game? I don't know. Uh, probably not. Hold on. Yeah, you you should let me. <laughs> gotcha. I mean, they gave it an eight out of ten. This game. Yeah, apparently. I... okay. <laughs> you did not agree with that. Uh, no, certainly not. <laughs> eight, 8 out of 10 for me implies, like, this is, like, a premium product, and, like, I'm sorry, but this game's a little too jank for a premium. Like, yeah, I would say, like, 7 out of 10. Like, yeah, I would say, like, max 7. Maybe, like, a 6. <laughs> like... Like a six or like a five to seven, I'd be okay with, if only because it's a perfectly average game. Because for me, five is middle of the road. It's fine, right? There's nothing wrong with it. It's just janky and but it's fun, you know. But like, yeah, I really like it, but it's probably because I don't think Spider-Man. <laughs> right, right, exactly. You're I love like all the references and passion behind everything. Yeah, exactly. But for me, who's like more of just a casual Spider-Man fan, I don't know. It's like. Neat little product, you know? Okay. Okay, video game. You can just fucking fuck off with that. That was... That... Yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a 4 out of 10 game right there. Uh, <laughs> Cries in God Hand 3.8 score. I never played God Hand, but I hear IGN was like the one review. People were like, what the fuck is this? How dare you? Okay, I think I I think they're good now. Like wait, uh, lower the game. wait, did IGN review the PS3 version? Uh, let's see. Under their review of the PS3 version, I say they play it on. If they do. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, I hope you're doing well too, Homecoming. You're not a you're not a fucking lawyer. You're like an electrician. What are you talking about? Thank Christ. Oh no, I I hear another fucking little shifty Samuel wherever the shifty Samuel. Uh, the golden spiders. Oh, oh my god, these guys these guys are Fucking gods. They are unstoppable gods. They're they have like forty twenty eyesight. They they their their eyesight is way too good. This this gang should be in, uh, in the next Spider-Man movie. <laughs> their eyes are as the youth say, poggers. <laughs> so I don't think IGN mentions what version they play that. Okay. Like control F, type in Xbox, nothing shows up or anything? Or like... I mean, or... how do you do that? Oh, uh, there's... Never mind, don't worry about it. It's fine, it doesn't matter. I was just gonna, I was just gonna say, if they played the PS3 version, then like... I hope all of like the the frame rate stuttering or the crashing is the emulation and not the PS3 version just being shit. <laughs> I can't imagine the PS3 version is that bad. But... See, but that's the thing is, oh my god, <laughs> this game hates me. I'm it's holding like, the X button to do that thing. And the game is just like, actually, you just did a regular jump, and now you're going to get spotted. How's that sound? And I'm like, no. I don't want that. No, thank you. Big no cheese. How do I crouch? Can I, like, crouch walk or something? Uh, there is no crouch in this game. Damn it, I want to play Metal Gear. <laughs> Yeah, cell phone is not. Oh my god! Holy fuck. These guys, okay, so when Goblin took that fucking fragment, he replaced all their eyeballs with sniper scopes. That's the only explanation that I have for this. This is this is actual balls. I hate this. This is this sucks. Can you imagine if actual actual cell phone had Ugh. I don't want to that. Yeah, I'm good. Finally, just <laughs> look. It may have been unnecessary that I punched you twice to do that, but it was worth it. I don't care I got spotted. What are you going to do? Come up here? You saw you. <laughs> I think there might be one more guy down there, but... Yeah. It's so hard. Alright, you know what? This guy, he's gonna be in Rush Hour 3. <laughs> he will kill all the, all the other contestants to be in Rush Hour 3. Okay, this, this fucking shit where I can't double jump and then do my boost upwards is dumb. It's fucking it's dumb. It's really inconsistent when I want to do that. And it's really annoying. Yeah. Uh, yeah, sorry. I had the same problem when I played it. <laughs> I don't know why. Content-wise, uh, I think I've asked this before, but content-wise, is the Wii version the same? It is the exact same. The only difference is motion controls. Of course. Motion controls for a lot of the combat moves. Uh, 
for those like people being punching segments and for when you're yeah. like pulling you like when you're pulling your skates off. That's gotcha. And you have to like point icon that the four corners of the thing to get the web to attach first and then swing your swing your remote. Gotcha. Everyone get in the Hayachi door. Get the fuck out of here. Is there, like, a specific reason goblins at the carnival, or no? Uh, yes. Um. Welcome. Welcome to my house. Why are you Dracula now? I thought you were a goblin! Why don't you sound like a cat? And these aren't Hihachi doors. So you gotta walk up to them and see which one. You gotta like examine their eye movements when you get close to them to see which one's different. Uh. Hey, Charles, open wide. Ah, uh, nope. Ow! Force it. I can't. I can't see the difference with any of them. And I did it. There is a difference, but certainly a twist. Okay. You want to check your uh, challenges and upgrades? Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> if I, if this is one of those situations where I didn't check it and I just happened to get like all but three of them, I'm gonna laugh. Feeling pretty good. Oh, damn it. Okay. Well, I got most of them, so. Now you can check what the other ones are. Yeah, that one you're not doing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, fuck that. Fucking sniper scope eyes over there. The what? That's the story thing. Well, do <laughs> automatically. Uh, and then. Yeah, I'm good. All right. And then upgrades. You have a lot of money. Sure do. Um, the quick charge would be good, right? Yeah. Oh wait, what's this? Oh, grabs in the air. I forgot about that. Mm -hmm. I feel like that would just drive me insane because I, I already have a hard enough time grabbing specific things. So. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Oh! oh that's so cool! Absolutely! Yo! I want that! <laughs> and check for the carriage upgrades too. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Like health upgrades and stuff. Okay, no. You've got yet. three challenges left to upgrade to unlock four of those. I've flipped my wig, or this room is. Oh, yeah! Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, I hate this. Oh, fuck this. So the challenge to finish this fight within two minutes. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> God, fuck off with your bat. It sucks.
Yes! Oh my god. Oh my god, Jess. Oh my god, Jess. This room sucks. <laughs> okay, I hit triangle, but sure, video game. Whatever you want to do. Alright, I can't lock onto him for some reason, and it's driving me insane. And the camera keeps rotating! Stop rotating! I'm just, I'm glad I don't have to look at that fucking effect anymore. That hurt my eyes. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess that was it. built this? Oh, no. Who built this? Why is it like... Oh, it's a roller coaster, I just realized. Oh, yeah. Don't. Don't. Just don't. Don't do this to me. Don't make me walk in there. Don't... It's just gonna spray me with the shit again. I don't wanna spray... Don't spray me with the shit again. What's that? What's you that, that mean? Effect, you have to figure out your way out with, uh, with, the, with the timer. Hey, Chuck, open wide. Wow. Nice. Finally. Not so fast. Why do you have a gun? What? What does he need a gun for? He's the size of a fucking car. Wait, where's the gun? It's in a holster. There. It's right there on his waist. You don't see it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Weird. Chug. I guess he uh, Ow. couldn't take what I was dishing out. Mm -hmm. I'll have my revenge. I'll tear this place down with my bare hands if I have to. Wait, he's not gonna. Is he? <laughs> That's uh not how it works. <laughs> I feel like there were eight conversations happening at once there. I just... <laughs> and now, and the Hi Hachi door is back. Yay. Are you going to stop? 
stand there babbling all night, or are we gonna end this? That's me. Okay. So the challenge to perform five left right games against them. You have no chance engaging in my head on. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna No sound. God, he's fucking annoying. <laughs> he keeps making these growling noises and it's driving me nuts. <laughs> That's fair. It takes up so much noise in my headphones. <laughs> I can't deal with it. Oh, well. Mm. Okay, you know what? Maybe no sound is a bit annoying. Never mind. I'm guessing FX is the the growling. That's true. You want to leave that silent? Or at least lower. Ow. Am I like not understanding how to hurt him? Is there like a specific thing I need to do? I think you need to be behind him. Yeah, I understood that I have to hurt him from like behind or whatever, but. But he just does that now. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, I think it's like when after he stomps the ground or when he's like doing that after a turn attack. God. Oh what? What? What hit me? He has a residue from his growl attack. My god, that's... See, there's no, like... <laughs> oh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Uh, jump over that. Jump over what? The gas. Yeah, I know, but when I'm like locked onto him, I can't jump. So it it's like very difficult for me to do that. <laughs> oh. Great. Maybe you reach while like waiting on the raptors uh, for him to do something. Come on. I will say the fight is easier now. 
What? Why didn't it? Oh my god, that just keep doing that, Spider-Man. <laughs> like, what are you doing? <laughs> like It should be easier to dodge now that he's just throwing a lot of giant weapons like the heavy guys. He he like he doesn't always do the same dodge and that's really throwing me off. I don't know why I still mash R1. It's very funny. <laughs> Man, the whole fight of the lights out this would be a million times easier. Yeah, right? You would think Spider-Man's, like, best course of action would be block out all the lights. Because then he could just always do that. Yeah, just take a few minutes and smash all the lights. Okay, so now there's a challenge to, uh... Yeah, I see. I see it. Yeah, I okay. see it. Alright, sorry. And while you're doing that, I'll... Uh, quite quickly go through his origin. Yeah, sure. Um... Uh, he has a local crime syndicate, uh, playing a gang of twisted people, uh, from the Carlo Free Show circuit. Uh, he collected his army to build a criminal empire based on two things he desired all his life, fear and respect. Uh, uh, Osborne adopted the mantra of Goblin the same way, oh, by growing up in a freak show. Uh, oh, gotcha. He typically conceals the hideous green scales that cover his body and inspire the name behind a fake flesh like mask. Are there a finite number of these guys? Uh, yes, I think so. Oh, okay, you can. You can... You could dodge Spider Man, it's okay. It's <laughs> God. That's basically a for his origin. Oh, okay, gotcha. He's a mob boss. And face base in the carnival. I feel like all of them have been mob bosses so far. <laughs> Well, and the other two, like, worked for Goblin. Oh, okay, gotcha. So close. Yeah, 
There we go. Jesus. <laughs> ah. Here's left. Oh, yo, let's go. <laughs> that was cool. that was cool. Jesus Christ. How is that a silver? How is that a silver? Oh my god. Why is Madam Webb even on the, the level clear screen? She She's barely in this game. <laughs> <laughs> she's a damn blown of stress by this point in the story. Yeah, she's in like 10% of this fucking game. Why is she here? <laughs> but the 10% that matters. All right. I don't know who's... Is this Scorpion? Who Who is this? I, I couldn't tell. <laughs> no idea. <laughs> you played the game! How do you not know? It's, uh, it's a tinkerer. Oh. Oh, wait, no, we've already fought Scorpion. Yeah. Oh, it's uh, Doc Ock. Yo, dope. It's a lady, Doc Ock. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> A villain with some sense. Oh boy, here we go. Free fall. <laughs> also, you might you need to speed up, hold the A button, whoever it is, because the explosion's gonna catch up with you otherwise. Well, like very seldom uh, slow down to dodge stuff. Oh, I was too short. Damn. Sure. Welcome to the Shadow Division, Spider-Man. Tomorrow's weapon developed today. And at the heart of it all, my masterpiece. Impressive, isn't it? Yep, it's... What do you mean, meh? <laughs> <laughs> that was actually pretty good. Yeah. Meh. Uh, am I supposed to be doing something or? Oh, okay. I don't know if it you walk away. Oh, don't, don't make me all, like, loopy again like that gas did. No, it doesn't. <laughs> you might want to rebalance this now. No. Yeah, I'm going to do that. So there's four major sections here, you can do them in any order. 
Ooh, nice. Uh, am I supposed to be going somewhere specific yeah. or? Fighting the guys. Oh, gotcha. This might be a while. These are just xenomorphs. Alright, this is. This is fucking obnoxious. <laughs> Where are you at? There you are. Stop it! <laughs> yeah, this guy's stuck. Don't forget you have the accelerator vision. Oh no! Famous. Oh, I'll turn on accelerator vision. And just fight the little guys. There you go. Okay, cool. Here's there's a challenge to fight to defeat five enemies in a single battle of that. There's also one that's just triggering MP, accelerated in five times. Gotcha. We're doing your flippy shit and just kick the guy. Blast him. What? Fucker. <laughs> so, so Doc Ock, Doc Ock is voiced by Tara Strong. Yo. Oh wait, no. That's not no. good. That's not good. She's into NFTs now. Oh shit. Right. But yo, oh, it. used to be cool. Yeah. Call it timeless game. Yeah. Doing all this flippy shit. Just kill him. <laughs> uh, was that it? Yeah, you're done with this section. Oh, is that the Avengers logo? <laughs> it, it looks the exact same. Yeah. Three more to go. But it's also the Apple X logo. Oh, okay. I guess they stole it. <laughs> they they <laughs> borrowed it without asking. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Uh. Did not did not let you do it. No. <laughs> okay. Hey, Yusuf. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Yo. Oh come on! <laughs> what the fuck? Stupid. 
I just, I just want to swing. Please stop shooting me. I just want to go to Cinnabon. To what? I just want to go to Cinnabon. <laughs> what is that? Oh, Cinnabon is like a pretzel and sweets store that is in the Midwest. Uh, Yusuf made a comment. Can you read it? I'm a little busy at the moment. Uh, not what? I cannot hear a fucking thing with this game right now. It's so loud. Alright, sorry. As I was saying, could you read... The you just can't because I I I can't because I didn't already have the stream up and for some reason when I pulled up uh, like midstream it shows nothing in the chat window. So there sent it to you. Am I okay. am I supposed right. to be doing something? Yes, there's a glowing spot on the ground. You have to lead her into hitting. Right there on the left. Oh. <laughs> there you go. Cool. Uh. uh so. Oh. Okay. That works too. <laughs> You're intending to like wide up it. Can you can you read it now? Yeah. I was getting to that. Sorry. Uh you know it would be very cool for the Spyro 2 PS5, PS4 game that Norman becomes the Green Goblin and the final boss in the, is the Green Goblin. But unite with them and in the post credits all the Spider Man from the previous games come out. Oh, that'd be cool. If he like also gets a symbiote. Or like it's him and that of the other. Yeah. Oh. Oh, okay. I guess I just wasn't allowed to land on that for whatever reason. Um Can you <sighs> Alright video game. This video game I'm hitting circle. I'm I was literally standing still and mashing circle. I don't know what was different between that time and any other time I did that. <laughs> What's a jackanape? <laughs> I don't know what a jackanape is. Can't get over this run cycle. <laughs> I I know it's late game, but I'm st it's it's still very funny to me. Ow. Another 
But yeah, but yeah, I I am hoping the uh, Spider-Man game on PS5 and PS4 is like really good. Yeah, I'm sure it will be. He. Yeah. No reason for it to not be good. Because <laughs> I know I'm pretty critical of those games, but like I still like them. So. <laughs> Okay. Don't you love when you just walk through the stun state? Not gonna fight him? Uh, nope. I'd rather leave. I've been working here for years, and I still can't believe that Halcon X just flat out ripped off the Avengers logo. What? Thank you. Uh, yeah. <laughs> He finally said it. Even some of my subordinates have accused me of megalomania. And let me guess, you listen to their concerns calmly with an open mind. Not quite. That was my answer. Public eye, we have an intruder at last four. Uh, I missed you guys. All security units, report to Section Delta. Hey, public eye. Uh, Yusuf said, or at all the planets of the multiverse version, there was a war between the Marvel characters and zombies and the planet of symbiotes. Oh, that'd be, that'd be wild. Yeah. I'd like to see that happen in the movies. But I feel like if they go to the planet of symbiotes, they'd be Sully that does that with their stuff, but... Yeah. yeah. Sure. That'd be fun to see. Just say shoot the whoop. Yeah, I don't I don't know what that means. <laughs> nice. Get around behind him. Also, I think you have enough your Donna challenges to unlock in our hull left bird. Okay. I'll take a look in a in it. Alright, this guy, he sucks. Get him out of here. Yeah, this level can get really annoying with enemies at times. I'm just throwing a lot at you. Lucky for you, I take requests. <laughs> you just went flying after destroying the door. I can connect the dots. Can you help me get through here? I can try. Hold on! The barrier's down. Good luck. What are you doing? No! Thank you. No! There must have been a power fluctuation. You gonna check the upgrades? Oh yeah. Okay. Yo, health. Yes. Nice. And you'll want the Rage thing for the next level. Yeah. Alright, cool. Nice knowing nice. you. Okay. Nice. Get the fuck out of here. Full speckles stop me. All you've done is ensure you're on the doom. What? Oh no. That's pure ecstatic radiation. Come to go. It'll flash fry you from the inside. Feel that behind you, Spider-Man. Feel those flames licking at your heels. Come on. Okay. Feel that behind you, Spider-Man. Feel those 
Come on. Get moving. Let's go. Yes, I feel it. Christ. Yeah, you keep saying it. Let me in. <laughs> Whatever you were saying, I'm sure it's very important, but I don't care. <laughs> Halfway there. Halfway there. <laughs> What's that a reference to? I feel like I should know. Uh, SpongeBob. Yeah, I, I figured. Let me in. Gotta fight people first. Why? Because it's combat time. It's, it's a fighting game. <laughs> wow, I didn't realize. <laughs> it's an action game. Alright. Across the ground. Yeah, he was like, whoop. <laughs> Jesus. Jeez, these guys take a fucking beating. Finally, Jesus. <laughs> yes. Time for a little. And while that's happening, I'm gonna go into the profile. Sure. Uh. She, so she leads a section of Alpha Max that performs a bunch of sick experiments like human testing, gene splicing, uh, addictive designer drugs. Um, da, 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 da. She fashioned a salt suit to, to counter uh, Spider-Man, uh, restraining a necessary tool. Uh, to maximize its effectiveness, she patterned it after the one worn by her idol, Dr. Otto Octavius. Oh, cool. Who, according to historical records, may have possibly uh, killed the you know, heroic age, ages, Spider Man, and climatic final battle. Oh, Gritch. I get it. Save the scientists, get them to deactivate the force field. Piece of cake. And she's, oh, and she's also um, a game original character. She's not in the comics. Oh, she's never existed before this? Nope. But um, it's hinted at that she's the one that created Hobgoblin and led Scorpion to grab the fragment. <laughs> that works. Oh! Okay. Uh. Else? No? Yeah, like, let's strike them. <laughs> Yo! I wish Insomniac Spider Man could do this shit. That That's cool as hell. <laughs> the, like, web strike comboing? Yeah. It's really nice. Yeah. That's a big thing in the the game of the shadows, which is like a, a sandbox game. Yeah. One of the moves you're literally taught at the start is how to chain web, web strikes. Oh, nice. Yeah. 
and then there's like there's different things you can go you can do from that depending on what suit you're wearing between wearing blue or black mm -hmm. like you can grind when you're web striking once you make contact you can grind the enemy across the ground oh wow yeah. or like flip them around or do all sorts of stuff or like when you're grabbing them you can slam them around or choke them to death Busy. <laughs> Those guys are gonna be up. They keep killing police officers. Yeah, well, Spider Man said, "Fuck cops." I mean, yeah. All right, big red and ugly. I'm... <laughs> Camera. Get out of here. Shoot you there. Uh, because I'm the fucking best. <laughs> I mean, I already knew that, but. Hey. Alright, one more to go. There's a big boy. Can you quit locking on to the fucking flying guys? <laughs> the guys that you can kill at one Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot I could do that to kill him. They keep, he keeps locking on to the fucking flying guys, and I don't like it. There. All right, hang on. I need to. I can take out these guys. There we go. Now I can breathe. Yeah. They kept shooting me, and they wouldn't stop. Yeah. What? There's all three of you here. Fuck off. I don't need to find shit. <laughs> Let me in.
Yep, definitely wanted to grab his gun and not the missile flying at me. I don't think you can grab the missile. Well, I thought I could, like, reflect it or, like, throw it back, like... Or is that something else I'm thinking of? You're thinking of the stop game. No, I, no, it was in this game. Or maybe you think of, uh, like, throwing bombs back at Hot Goblin Miller? Oh, maybe. Yeah, because these missiles here you can't touch. You can just redirect them. Hey, I did it. Goodbye. Get the fuck out of here. This is for you to watch because when I would play this game, I would just spend all the time fighting every enemy for as much points as I can get. Yeah, see, I'm I'm not I'm not going for high scores. <laughs> I mean, for the the essence stuff for the upgrades. Oh, that's true too. Thank you. <laughs> yes, you don't need to show me where the, it is every time. Like, I, I, I can tell. I, I'm i 29 years old. I know how to see. <laughs> You're very large cables. Very obvious what you are doing. Are you ready for this again? Oh, fuck me. All right. <laughs> Let's try this again. No. Aha! Need a hand. Oh, fuck you! Okay. Uh, Spider-Man. Uh, Spider-Man. <laughs> Whatever. Fuck it. I'm not going for it. <laughs> oh my god, these fucking kamikaze grunts! Oh my god, these guys are driving me nuts! Just let me kill her! There we go. Fuck your arm! Thank god you only have to do it twice. I grab what what was that it's like this flying uh main it's drone or whatever okay so this part sucks hope you're ready there's a shitload of enemies that are gonna be coming in and you can't let the scientists die great yeah this part's fun
Until this stops working, I'm gonna keep doing it. I don't remember if this is time based or defeating everyone. Okay, sometimes it just doesn't read my jump, and I'm not sure why. Yeah. Probably when that happens. I mean, it gets them away, and that's the point. I mean, yeah, but I think it's only a kill us. Oh yeah, it's probably kill base then. Yeah. There we go. Now he can die. Oh, I'm so annoyed. Um, Fireman? Um. Wait, maybe they shoot at you? There we go. There we go. <laughs> Thanks for unfreezing me, guys. I was really scared there for a second. <laughs> So yeah, why play this last? Uh, this took me. This took me like two or three tries. Well, I guess the spire stop strat worked. There we go. That's all four. I don't have to do like another four, do I? No. No. That's it. Okay. Gotta go in and beat her up. Get a good shot at it. Did you want to check your for upgrades again first? And the web of destiny. Come on, mommy needs a new pair of shoes. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, I got a All decent right. amount of them. Let's go. Not too bad. Uh, over upgrades. I don't mean to bash you, I'm just making sure you don't forget to check these. There. <laughs> <You've shut laughs> Sorry. It's okay. No, it's okay. It was funnier to do that. This is gonna kill you. Ah, uh, fuck you! supposed to do jump over the tiles what tiles 
the glowing tiles on the floor. There weren't any. I was standing on purple. All the lit up ones were in the center. I think they moved out. Well, it wasn't very clear about that. And the camera angle just faced it upwards, so I couldn't see that. There we go. Now I can see them. Oh. Ow. Uh, okay, why would it give me the option to do that if it's just... I'm glad I was able to stand there. That was very funny. Yeah. I'd like to see you survive this. Okay. <sighs> you alright? Yeah, it's fine. What? Why didn't she do the move again? <laughs> you gotta jump over the trackway. Sure, what? Why would it give me the option if she can still hurt me? Why is she giving me the option with the shield still? That's what I just said! <laughs> yeah. Try to put What's it doing? Hey, what? The game is pushing out here. Yes. Um. How am I supposed to hit her? The shield's supposed to go away after she does. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you so much. Sure. <laughs> what, a, what a dumb fucking game. <laughs> there we go. Can you do it like on the edge of her shield? Yeah. I don't know why the shield is even still up. If it lets you do that, but whatever. I... I literally can't move, because, like, I need to stay locked on so I know where she is, but I can't jump, because I'm locked on! <laughs> ah. Did you have to do this in the Wii game at all? The her shield always being up thing? Yeah. Uh, I don't remember it being like that. But... Wait, didn't you also just play this version recently too? Yeah. And she never did that. God. I'm, I'm fairly certain her shield is supposed to go away when it lets you do the on max thing. But whatever. 
It's the... Okay, so I think that is what you have to do, because the fact they made, like, a whole animation for it means that, like, clearly this is intended. Like, it yeah, wasn't that, some that weird glitch. That is what you're supposed to do. It's just don't let the shield her slow up. What? The shield was in her... Fucking... It was covering everything! More like Dr. Crocker shit. <laughs> Riveting. <laughs> the most exhilarating boss fight. Nope. Sorry, eight-year-old kid. You you were two inches off. You aren't allowed to get her. <laughs> yeah. All right, there we go. Okay. Trying to jump. I so it just starts to be like so precise with your positioning. Yeah. What? So the challenge at this part of the fight to let her laser the creatures five times. You say that after I just destroyed one with your own shitty laser. <laughs> not, she's not very bright. <laughs> Ironic, given that her ability has lots of blinking lights. I mean, I'm just gonna... I'm getting free experience for this. I might as well keep grinding these guys out. I mean, yeah. Uh, okay, game. Whatever. <laughs> I'll fuck you. How many of these do I need to fight? Uh, what? <laughs> Excuse me? You were supposed to throw the bombs they drop at her. I don't know what happened there. Wait! Could it have been like, as I was lasering guys, they were dropping bombs and they were close enough to her to hurt her? I guess so. <laughs> what do uh, you mean only a bronze? <laughs> I got all of them. That is not nearly all of them. <laughs> I mean, that's, a, that's at least like 80% of them, right? Like, you know? Mmm... Mm. I feel like I'm pretty close. I feel like you're way off the mark. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh, yo, this is the mode where I can just spam my thingy. Yep. In just a rage mode. <laughs> as much as it upsets you that I do that. <laughs> What is this? I don't know what this is. You're gonna find out. <laughs> oh no. No, no, no. I've seen this before. This red goop. The body's drained to husks. 
It's Batman. Oh. <laughs> Oh wait, is it what I, is it what I think it is? Yeah, let's go. This is this is the coolest addition to the whole fucking game. Let's go, let's go. Yeah, so Carnage and Ultimate is kind of terrifying because he's just a creature. He doesn't have a host. Oh. And, uh, like he like drains the life out of people. Like you saw with those husks. Why are we walking, Spider-Man? My God, it's a massacre. So Carnage is just like a fucked up alien, then? I mean, that's all he ever was, but like in this one, he's specifically just that. And now with the fragment, you can reanimate them, so you're fighting zombies on this level, basically. Yo, dope. <laughs> Yeah, so, just like the black suit he was, uh, man-made, um, he was created from a combination of Peter's blood, uh, I think the sample of the lizard's DNA, um, cause Dr. Connell's kind of the one that made him. Yeah. As well as, like, following the notes of making the black suit. Oh, okay. So, you wound up like a, a red goofy monster. At first, he was like the size of a toddler, and he started like murdering like families as they walked by the streets. And when he did that, absorbed their energy, he like grew. He, oh, like, he could sustain himself. Oh, that's that's a special kind of fucked up. Yeah. So eventually, he grew to be like the size and shape of how Carnage is supposed to look. But then he like kept absorbing energy and then he turns a Peter for some reason. Like to impersonate him? Get away from me. Yeah, I literally like he, like took the form of Peter. Because I apparently that's what happens when you're made of his blood. <laughs> Weird. Yeah. And then uh Carnage is actually the thing that killed Gwen Stacy in the Ultimate Universe. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Uh, and Carnage's game is voiced by Fred uh, Tetasior. Tetis What's what has he done? Let me check. Don't you mind explaining what the hell is going on? Carnage. Yeah, that much I got. That red monster, a clone. That's what we call him. Prisoner nine hundred M. Case designate Carnage. He escaped while uh, we were studying him. I managed to lock him out of here. Oh, why would you give him the fragment? You're idiots. All of you. Roasted. Roasted. Yeah, Shield of the Zero sucks. They're awful. Like, evil awful or just stupid? Like, you know, the whole thing of the government, like, doing really dumb experiments that you should expect would make things bad. Gotcha. So, like, um, they take a sample of Peter's blood, like, after Carnage destroyed it, and use it to make clones of Peter. Um, oh. Because they, they know he's Spider-Man. Um... So at least a little clone saga and stuff. There's like, there's this clone of them that's the scorpion. There's like a one with extra arms. Um, 
Here's one with half his face melted off. Uh, there's a clone of Gwen Stacy. And there's a clone of him that looked like Peter's father that just ended up being an aged up Peter. Weird. And there's also a female Peter clone that ends up becoming that universe's uh, Spider Woman. Yo, nice. Yep. Like, yeah, Shield and the is messed up. Um, after the clones end up getting boosts, uh, Nick Fury ends up going to Peter, because apparently like, the way the laws are with clones, uh, they have to arrest the original person when clones are going around or something. What? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. After, like, after some clones start popping up, um, and Peter and his may meet with who they assume is Richard Parker and Gwen Stacy. Um, Shield shows up like surrounding their house with tanks and like like a ton of guards and helicopters to to make, to like take him. And Peter just just you know dashes out of the house and fights them with all ham pissed off um, and gets help from uh, the Fantastic Four and I think some mutants to fight oh. S.H.I.E.L.D. Gotcha. <clears throat> oh, and another fun thing from that arc is that towards the end to find out like I think the creator of the clones is actually Dr. Octopus or Octavius. Yeah. And you find out, like, his arms have been severed and melted, but you find out that Otto is a mutant and can control metal. What? <laughs> this is just a lot going on. <laughs> yeah. So, like, he causes, he causes this, like, giant trail of metal parts going around and forms giant metal... Uh, tentacles from debris. <laughs> you find out that he's basically a Magneto if he only uses the great tentacles. Oh. <laughs> the Ultimate Universe has a lot going on, apparently. Yeah, and the only good part of it is Spider-Man. <laughs> Damn, roasted. But it's also funny because, like... Ultimate is where they get a lot of inspiration for cartoons or like the MCU. <laughs> they Do they make, make good. good things? Yeah, they just, I was about to say, but they make good things out of it instead. <laughs> <laughs> um, like, like, uh, Nick Fury being black, Samuel Jackson. Um, like Jarvis being an AI, because in the, in the main comics he's an actual butler. Oh, gotcha. Um, or the, like the fact that Avengers is formed by Shield, which is the ultimate, instead of forming it themselves. And I think like some armor that's been in the like Iron Man armor is like ripped straight from his ultimate comics. Is there is there a particular reason they take a lot from Ultimate or no? Uh, I'm not sure. I guess like I think part of the conceit of the Ultimate Universe was making it a bit more grounded, um, so it's a bit easier to adapt. Because like the main universe was all radiation for stuff and. Ultimate, it was mainly science and people like trying to recreate super soldiers. Yeah. Doing genetics. Like, that's where Hulk was uh, trying to recreate a uh, super soldier. I think they use that in the movies too. Yeah, they do. Yeah. Whereas in the, in the main comics, it was just a game of bomb. That. 
of Banner got hit with. And instead of dying, he became the Hulk. Do they ever explain, like, how that worked out like that, or...? just how stuff like that works in the Marvel Universe, apparently. They yeah. With radi radiation sit. Instead of killing you, you do superpowers. Yeah, because I was just curious if there was, like, a specific reason Banner was, like, not immune to it, but, like, didn't die from it. Because radiation is a magical thing, apparently. Oh my god, it is magic. I mean, it's the same thing with Spider-Man. Like, that Spider-Man should have killed him. Or he should have just... Like, dealing with disease or something. Yeah, right. Like, poison them. <sighs> oh, wow. Uh, so, the voice actor for Carnage's game who plays. The King of Cornelia in Strangers of Paradise. Oh my god, what? Let's go! <laughs> yeah. That is wild. Uh, you played some characters in The Loud House and Teen Titans Go. Uh. You play some characters with Family Guy. That, oh, I mean, that makes sense. A lot of minor characters in that show. Uh, he's a character in Halo Infinite. Oh, uh, nice. Lock. I don't know who it is, but. Uh, oh, I, I never played the story mode, so I wouldn't know. Okay. I'm waiting for the, the co op to come out. Oh, he voices a few characters in the What If series. Oh, nice. Anyone specific or just like side uh, characters? Uh, Drax, Volstag, and Cor Corvus Glaive. Oh, rich. Yeah, he goes around. <laughs> yeah, he gets him. He gets around a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> So, so, uh, in the comics, he killed Carnage by, like, throwing him into a smokestack. Oh. Did that, like, take him out, I guess? Yeah, he was destroyed. But oh. But then he, like, in the lab where he was created, there was, a, there was another sample of Peter's blood that they used for a stuff. Oh, gotcha. So the original Carnage was destroyed. In a, in a fucking smokestack. That's a very anticlimactic way. <laughs> is it? I don't know. I, I a smokestack is kind of like. It, did the smoke get him, or you know, like? Like, him down it, like to the fire or whatever. Okay, the fire got him. I thought I thought it was just the smoke itself. That's why I was confused. Yo, that'd be cool. I just like this monster. On the right side, I think I found an escape route. So it also wanted to work because it's primarily based on Peter, but whatever. 
I mean, I mean, we all thought Venom wouldn't work, and that movie was like, it worked, I guess. <laughs> it, it technically worked. <sighs> all right. I don't know. I I liked the Venom movies, but I know not everyone was a hundo on them. I don't think they're good by any means, though. <laughs> Yeah, um, I didn't care about anything in the first movie when I watched it. It's like, it's the most indifferent I've ever felt about a no movie. Way. Great, because things weren't sucky enough. These mini carnages. I know I'm going to have to fight all these things. I just know it. Yep, and there we go. Range. Time for range mode. Oh wait, are these guys? Hang on. What? <laughs> Can I get him with this? I don't think it ever does damage. I mean, it killed a couple guys. Oh my god. Not not here, but like in the electric level. Well, cause those are the guys you kill in one hit. <laughs> yeah, so it did some damage. <laughs> I do really like how uh, the third ultimate level is on the Triskelion because shields are very prominent in the ultimate comics. Mm -hmm. So it makes sense. Like, to the point, like, he's constantly meeting up with Nick Fury to talk to him. And Nick Fury's like, you need to calm down. You're acting like a dumb teenager. Oof, roasted. <laughs> Which I mean, he is. Fifteen. It's yeah, like that's true. A lot. I mean, that's true. Um. Yeah, and stuff with like Clone Saga ha having shield heavily involved. Also, I think this it's this room where uh, there's a fun Easter egg in all the cells. Uh, what is it? Go wait and see if you can find it. I have to go find the guy. No. And it'll be fine. I don't remember which cell it is, but it's one where uh, the shield is up. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Let me just tell you what it is. There. Who is that? Oh, it's There's Deadpool electric. and fucking Electro. Yep. That's very That's funny. Really funny. It's also cool because it's kind of accurate to the comics where most and not every time where he defeats a uh, supervillain, they end up in shield custody. It's arguable I would call this place safe. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't think it would be safe.
remember, you can't stop the rage mode early if you want to. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oof. Did he say door? Door! Oh. It'd be funnier if he just screamed door. Hello. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, he has no remorse for trying to kill Carnage. Cause he's just a creature, he's just a monster. <laughs> yeah. And he literally like, needs to kill people to live. Also, he's really creepy, so there's that too. <laughs> I'll get him eventually. Yeah, I mean, I can do that, it says, but. Yeah, when you, you need to for a challenge, but it's really awkward trying to get him to uh, land there. Why are you saying that to a literal monster who kills people? You know the best time for a moral lesson. There you go. <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> that was really dumb. He's just like, ah, and then falls in. <laughs> Oh, fuck you. That move is done. Nothing's working. Great. I mean, it'll load me at a checkpoint, right? So. Yeah, probably the start of this fight. That's fine. Alright, give me one second. I've got to close it out. How has this game crashed so much? Uh, I'll, I'll be honest. I'll, I'll chalk that up to emulation. That's just a thing. Because, uh... PS3 emulation is still being worked on. It's not perfect. <laughs> That's fair. It's still weird because when I did it with the same thing, I didn't. I don't think I had a single crash. Oh, weird. I wonder why. I'm just better. Uh, I don't. I don't know if that's how it works, babe. Gonna be real. What? You know what? Here, it's like, I'm oh, gonna... she's a big spider fan. We're gonna work perfectly. I mean, I'm a, I'm a fan. Like question mark? Like kinda? Mostly. I like Spider Man. He's my favorite. I just don't read any of the comics. <laughs> and I saw Homecoming I mean, like way after it came out. <laughs> I've also read very few of the comics, so. 
I would like to read more if I had twice as much time. I'm afraid to get you like a subscription to like Comixology or something like that. Oh, Comixology for my first god awful now. Oh, it is? I didn't know. Yeah, Amazon has like run into the ground. That's a bummer. Yeah. But the the main subscription you get for Marvel stuff is Marvel Unlimited. Which oh, is, which uh, is like just their like it's all our comics and that's it. Yep, yeah, it's theirs, you pay for it, uh so subscription and you you have access to like thirty thousand thirty thousand comics. Oh wow. Yeah. It's weird to the think that they've actually made that many. I mean, it's been a thing since at least the 30s, I think. True. 30s, 40s. Very true. Yeah. Um, yeah, the, the one downside to it is that you have to wait, like, several months if you're trying to read current comics. It takes that long for new ones to be added, apparently. Oh, they're not, like, day and date? Nope. See, now that doesn't make any sense to me. You would think... Because, no offense to, like, comic book fans, but, like, no one buys comics anymore, right? Like, nope. exactly. So, like, you would think it would incentivize people more if you were to do day and date with, like, the app, you know? Yeah. You would think. And plus, everything's digital anyway, so now you just don't print it, you know? Like that's yeah. the the only difference is you save a shit ton of trees. <laughs> <laughs> the one downside is, is it it does like it doesn't help at all the the comic stores like dedicated comic shops like not doing great on their own. Yeah, that's true. But maybe, they, maybe they could have some kind of deal at the digital store but it also helps them somehow. Um, I mean, they could still do like, like trades, like, like compilations of stories, right? Like those and make those like a bigger deal. So people get like physical copies yeah. of the stuff. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. I feel like if you want a ton of money, you start advertising that, Hey, we have comics day and date. And then eventually like, this is how you read them. But eventually we'll release the full story in like a physical collector edition or something, you know? Yeah. I don't. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe I'm like not the person to talk to since I don't even read them. But. <laughs> but like. Like when I tried to get into the Sonic comics, I like the IDW ones. Like I, I was reading them as they were going, and then they started introducing like a thousand spinoff stories, and I was just like, okay, I'm done. I'm not. I'm not buying all this. I can't. Like I. Phys I physically cannot afford all this, because like. What, whatever I spend on, you know, like, comics or whatever, like, I could just, I could get longer enjoyment and more repeated enjoyment from other activities like gaming. So. Yeah. And they, they, uh, they had for a while, I'm not sure it's still going, but, like, with Game Pass, you can get, like, a three-month subscription to Marvel Unlimited. Oh, nice. Yeah, they have that deal going. That's a good deal. People should take advantage of. <laughs> good stuff. <laughs> I mean, have you have you have you used Marvel Unlimited or no? I haven't myself. Um, but well, it seems really fake good. fan. <laughs> I would get it if I had the time to read comics as in addition to other things. <laughs> yeah, that's. I don't know how to really balance it. That's fair. I would love just going ham on reading tons of that stuff. Yeah, understandable. Oh, I was hoping it would land on the funny one. <laughs> you can always revisit earlier levels to complete any challenges. Is that a crashed yep. Skip. Oh wait, these are the punchy. This is Punch Out. Yep. Punch Out was the creature. 
Where are the sound effects? Oh, I heard one. Did you ever rebalance the audio? Yeah, that's what I'm checking now. I thought you did. Oh. Okay. This creature is vulnerable to heat. Oh, you don't like catching on fire? Too bad. Ow. Tend to not. I I'm I feel like most things don't, regardless of their weakness. Yeah. I remember in the lead up to the Bad and Blues, me and a friend would joke about them doing this specific version of Carnage because it's literally made from Peter's blood. So it'd be a lot harder to against. Eesh. True. Like, how the fuck did you do this? Then again, you're now being a man of blood, so whatever. Can't wait I, for that. I still don't know why they're doing that. No one cares. What a nothing reaction he had to that. <laughs> Come on! Oh. Oh, thanks for the redo, Carnage. If you had them, thanks for giving me a take two on that. I'll stop doing it. That was not unexpected. All right, now I'll kill him. I do love when this version of Karch is like tentacles coming out of his body that are constantly moving around. Yeah, they're all like wiggly and stuff. Yeah. I know the, uh, artists for Ghostman Comics really wanted to do that in the main comics, but editorial didn't want that because they just wanted them to look like a skinny red, uh, Venom. Lame. Yeah. So they you finally got to do that with the ultimate stuff. Maybe we don't. For that control tower. Maybe go on vacation. Uh oh. Oh. Time to go. Oh. Wait, how did that work? Don't worry about it. I never want to do that again. Yeah, I can't All blame you. Personnel out of this area immediately. No! Don't bring oh, carnage! We've taken heavy damage from infected together. 
Sorry, one second. I needed to check something. We're okay. Alright. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave y'all to it. So many guys here. Hit combo. Yeah, I did that earlier and I got a trophy for it. Nice. This, uh, this is why I love the ultimate levels. You just go insane with it. With the rage mode. 150. Running animation is so good. <laughs> Just keep following Carnage up and up until there's nowhere left for him to run. Why does it keep giving me a prompt? <laughs> guns? Not in this timeline. No guns allowed. It's lasers only. Uh, am I supposed to be doing something, or...? Um, you gotta protect the... the guys from these creatures. While they take care of the egg. You also don't need to worry too much about them getting killed, because then you'll just show up. Kirby, no! <laughs> that was... That was very good. That was not it. That should have killed him. I hate that it's always just down. Stop him! I can't believe Herbie 2 is dead! Shut up, Welling. <laughs> I just mashed left on that last part. It was very funny. <laughs> Oh, 
think that challenges for letting some out of the shield agents die. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> Which is very easy to do. Um. Fried eggs! <laughs> he won't expect the left hand <laughs> every time. <laughs> I don't know why that was so. What? <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Minimized carnage. That's a very. That's a. That's a good name. I like that one. Yeah, because there's a carnage story called Maximum Carnage. Well, yeah, that's. I get. Yeah, that's why I said it was yeah. a good one. <laughs> and there's also a story called Minimum Carnage, or something like that, where <laughs> literally just a, a ton of tiny carnage. Carnages. Hey, not bad, webheads. They fought their way from <sighs> one dimension to the next, faced a number of their most fearsome foes, and found the final fragments of the fabled Tablet of Order and Chaos. But they're not done yet. Remember, there's still a damsel in distress. So what are you waiting for, heroes? Hop to it! What now? I can't give the final tablet piece to Mysterio, but if I don't, it's lights out from Adam Webb. Thanks, Spidey. Think. After years of pretending, of faking my way with special effects and stage magic, to have a taste of the real thing. Whoa! Chill out. <laughs> this mysterious. <laughs> what a dick! The tablet. It's reassembling itself. Great. Great. You just. Do I like web it away from them? No. Okay. Don't worry about me, I'm getting a movie soon. Uh -huh. until all is Last chance. With the walls of reality broken, I can summon your counterparts from the other worlds. The four of you, together, are reality's only hope. Hell yeah. You want to check for upgrades one more time before the end? Yeah. Yeah. Yo, Carnage? That was a great level. That was, like, legit just, like, a fun level. Uh, yeah. Alright, there we go. Um, yeah, character upgrades. There we go. Um, hell yeah. And you don't have to worry about challenges with... Mysterio. Oh, okay. Cool. I might as well just grab the rest of these. Yeah. Maybe oh, well. I never unlocked his charge attack! <laughs> Oops. Eh. <laughs> you still never will. Who needs it? Oh. So do I get to pick which spider I want, or... Um, make sure you check for Karen Aquarius too, for doing anything good there. No, so we probably uh, only have more available for it. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah, I'll go for the air grab. Yeah, sure, why not? There we go. And then I think I got all the ones I can get here. Yeah, okay. And I don't really care about that one. 
And I'll put everyone in a different suit for the for the last level. Nah, I'm good. Okay. Time for Mysterio. Is it just a boss fight or is it a whole level? It's a long boss fight. I command reality itself. Now you don't need to get a swelled head about it. So uh, I hope. Awesome. Did you ever play Arkham Asylum? Uh, no. Okay, so there's a section in that game with with Scarecrow that's like near identical to this. Oh, okay, I know that part because uh, I I've, I've seen like reviews of it, so I do know that part. Yeah, it's, like really funny. So this it's like. These two had the exact same idea for a boss thing at the same time. I will christen my new dimension with your ashes. You're full of something. <laughs> Got him. When did uh, Arkham come out relative to this? Like, same year, or...? I think it was only about a year ago. Let me double check. You would defy me? Me, who is one with the whole of creation? Quit saying it. It's not funny on the ninth time. <laughs> so Arkham Asylum was released in August 2009, and this game was released September 2010. Oh, uh, so it did. So, it did have a bit of time between them. Yeah, so it's close enough where they might have taken inspiration from it, but it's hard to say for sure. Yeah, it could have been. Oh wait, I, I, I'll see you crawl? Like, I'm literally a web crawler. Yeah, I just do that by default. You never see it, no, Yeah, you didn't need a tablet to do that. Yeah, this isn't your first time fighting me, dude. Really? Sounds fast. Tell me more. I like how his face is like a, a giant skull. Yeah, it's, it's really cool. I will yeah. christen my new dimension. With your ashes. I'm real intimidated. Really? Sounds fascinating. Tell me more. Whew. And now I end you! What? I prefer if you didn't. Yeah, I'm good. I'm good on that. <laughs> Bad plan. Actually, an arachnid. <laughs> um, actually, um. <laughs> I mean, that's something that Spider would do a lot in like cartoons. <laughs> Oof! Damn, dude. <laughs> and I'm free. <laughs> oh, it didn't give me the R2 prompt. I'm also literally a child. Yeah, he is the shortest one. <laughs> I just call he's like <laughs> Hey, what's so funny? Did you see a reflection of your outfit? Imagine me being threatened by an itsy bitsy spider. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's hilarious. I, I think it's really busted that I can just get free rage by, like, hitting people while I'm in rage mode. I mean, it is, but it's really fun. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm glad they do it. It's just very funny that, like, it's completely busted. It's, like, completely not fair. Yeah, hit this button when the meter is full to turn on God mode. To destroy you. Which is funny because the accelerator vision with 29 is not nearly as helpful. Oh, it's the cannon guy. Yep. Uh, yeah. Use my own creations against me. 
I didn't... I didn't do anything against you. That's what most boss fights are. Wash you out. And with that, super villain banter hits an all-time low. Roasted. Oh, it's Ridley. Ridley? <laughs> it's a purple dragon. <laughs> they added him here before they added him to Smash. <laughs> Damn. Got like what four years before? What, what, what was Smash for? Uh, Smash for Wii U was 2014. November 27th. Uh, it's, it's because Wii U was all I had at the time and I oh. I needed the hype. <laughs> so sorry. It's okay. You didn't have other consoles at the time? Uh, at the time, no. I, th I had a PS3, but I, I had played everything I have on it, so... Uh, well, mostly everything. I didn't play literally everything I had, but like for the most part, Wii U was my only like new stuff console at the time. Yeah, that's unfortunate. <laughs> I mean, I did have 3DS, I guess, but I don't really like the 3DS, so <laughs> that didn't that didn't pan out well. What is he capable yeah. of? You're not doing a great job of that. Uh, I don't know what was going on there, but okay. Thanks for giving me a platform, Mysterio. I really appreciate it. You could, you could literally just not make a platform, and I would lose. Oh no! It's a speedrunner! I'm aware. Shut up. Okay. Wee. Falling again? You know, standing on solid ground is so twenty ninety eight. Twenty ninety eight. I grow weary of this battle. This should finish you. Ow. Okay, maybe it will finish me. What are you trying to say, Jess? You saying I couldn't do it? You're saying you got hit. What are you trying to say? <laughs> Mysterio was right. <laughs> Mysterio was right! Ow. Oh my god! Oh my god! 29 days! Chill! <laughs> it's okay! Was that the fastest section? Oh, there oh there's more. I thought that I thought that was the I thought that was it. Nope. Oh, okay. I mean this and Noir are definitely the faster ones. I don't know if Noir was fast. It took a long time, but it just wasn't a lot of riveting gameplay. <laughs> well not fast, but I think it went uh it was shorter than the ultimate. It just feels like it was. I mean, it certainly helps the ultimate one is like you're actually playing the game. Yeah. What? 
I didn't hit. Okay, that one I hit. That that was on me. God fuck! God damn it! Fuck you! Fuck you so much! I hate you! I hate you! Okay. <laughs> One more time. I wonder if these are fixed or not, so you could, like, learn the pattern and then, like, speed run it. Uh, I'm not sure. Ow. Woo! Ow! <laughs> Dude, just break your fucking helmet! <laughs> Between your voice at the end. Yeah, it is. I already switched to amazing, but whatever. I've always found that really weird. What? Um. That I uh, have no idea what that was. Am I supposed to be doing something, or...? Yes. Uh oh. Because show all these big platforms. I will say, I feel like the amazing, the amazing section is the weakest one. Yeah, but he has the suit. The suit? Yeah, the classic suit. Yeah, I mean, it's not as fun as oh. Ultimate. He can't just turn on Gombo and win. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, he can't just go fucking Dynasty Warriors on everyone's ass. Yeah. Now I'm just imagining like an actual Dynasty Warriors Fireman game. That'd be really weird. Okay, how many creatures are there? I'm getting kind of tired of this. Yeah. The problem with this is that Amazing is not as well equipped to defeat large groups of enemies as ultimate. So it's a bit more of a pain. That wasn't even all of them! There's a guy standing right there! Don't worry about it. Oof. Nice. Oh, fuck you. Hang on a sec. Where is it at? What? Combat. There we go. Okay. Hang on. How do I? How do I do that? No, 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 not that one. What's the? 
Hmm. What's what? the one where I turn into like a thousand dudes and I go crazy? I think that was... Is that A-Legged Fury? Oh no. Um... I don't remember. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It is that one. Okay. Oh, it's airborne targets. So I launch them square, square, triangle, square. Okay. Got it. Oh, that's not it. Oh my god! Quit throwing shit at me! Any pastings wants to deal with your health. Finally, Jesus Christ. Yeah. Right, is this like time. the. Oh, one more time. I was about to say, is this like the last bit here? Yeah, this is the last section. And that's the end of the game? Yeah. It's finally near the end. Oh, nice. Fucking smoke balls are driving me nuts. I hate that. <laughs> so close. God. This goes on a little longer than it needs to. Yeah, it's because this Spider Man sucks. <laughs> Which is funny because it's the main one. Apparently I mean, he's. Be the best. <laughs> In terms of like, like gameplay though, I still prefer the, this Spider Man over. Fucking twenty ninety nine in Noir, so it's it's not a great vibe Turned around, he's like, I'm good. Alright. Oh, stop! I'll give you the tablet. I'll give you anything you want. Don't! Don't! No! <laughs> Ow. I'll listen to all you want to Yo! We did it! Hell yeah. Wait, the tablet. No, it could still be mine. It could still. Some guys never learn. And uh, speaking of learning, you should learn how to count. Something tells me you're outnumbered. <laughs> Noir was ready to beat his ass. <laughs> oh, there he goes. Nice. Nice. 
city are rebuilding themselves. And now, you must all return to your own dimensions. See you later, older and less cool versions of me. <laughs> Roasted. To me, all you guys are ancient history. Good to know there is a future. And men like you to carry on the good fight. Word. Bye, guys. <laughs> Word. <laughs> Supervillain daycare. Thank you, Spider Man. You should be proud to know your legacy is being upheld across time and space. Yeah, those guys were all right, but you have to admit, with four different Spider Men, the one thing I know for sure out of all of them, I'm the best. Yo, nice shot. Yo. One of the most titanic Love that bit. Of all time. And what have we learned here today, Marvelites? That Don't no matter call me that. corner of the cosmos you may find yourself in, there'll always be a friendly neighborhood Spider-Man to save the day. And to all of you web-spinning wonders, I Yo. say Excelsior! Hell yeah. Yeah, let's go. Level clear. I was, some, like, <laughs> some small part of my brain wanted it to crash at the very end. <laughs> God. No. That was been awful. It would have been very funny, though. Yeah. Easy as pie. Wait, is that spider ham? Oh, that's weird. Is this normal? <laughs> so, uh, before we go into your thoughts, I do want to point out one more cool thing. Um, yeah. It should show up in the credits in a little bit, but um, <clears throat> the writer of this game is Dan Slott, who is a big comic book writer and wrote years of Spider-Man stories in the comics. Uh huh. And uh, four years after four years after this game came out, he wrote Spider Verse. Oh, so, like the movie. No, like the, the original comic story. Oh, even better. Whatever. So They're like, all... That's so hype. So, this might have been the inspiration for the Spider-Verse stuff and the movies. Oh, that's true. He, he like... You know... Writer. Yeah, he, he could have been, like... He had him in his brain when he was writing them all, you know? Yeah. That's so cool. Oh... <laughs> <laughs> Why are you... <laughs> you're covering his junk! That was a bit in the level, if you remember. Yeah. I love all these, like, showing what the villains are up to now. Oh, that's... That's a special kind of fucked up. You don't do that to somebody. Yeah. It's horrifying. It really is. But, uh, okay, so, my thoughts. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna open it up on a bit of a sour note. I'm never coming back to this. Um, but, I didn't have a bad time. Like, it was janky, and I, wait, Alexander Lassard 1 and 2? There are two people named Alexander Lassard? <laughs> Hello? Uh, Oh, um, they're, they're like psychic, I guess. <laughs> Doing oh, it's hanging on his claw. Yeah. Okay, I thought he was like holding it above his hand and it was like floating. Um, no. But uh, like it was jank and I had my frustrations, but like I had a good time and it's it's pretty funny at points. And then yeah. learn, learning about, like, the different universes and stuff. Because, like, I know nothing about the Ultimate Universe at all. Yeah, I love how they play off all the three universes and making them feel, like, ac actually accurate to the comics. Yeah. And there, there were a couple groaner jokes in there every now and then. But overall, it was, it was a good game. It was perfectly acceptable. Like, it was it was a good time overall. So, so thank you yeah. for sharing this with me, honey. You're welcome. 
What was your favorite dimension? Uh, it, Ultimate. Like, no questions asked. Ultimate was the only yeah. time I was like, this... I mean, and, and that's the thing. I think Ultimate has, like... It has less depth in the gameplay than fucking Dynasty Warriors does, which is, like, <laughs> next to nothing. But... <laughs> But, like, overall, in this game, I had a good time with it because it had humor to go with it. In Dynasty Warriors, it's, you know, it's literally just killing and nothing else. Whereas, you know, even if I don't enjoy the other gameplay styles as much, it at least mixed it up, you know? Yeah. But, yeah, and, yeah, and Ultimate Ultimate's, was my favorite. Yeah, and Ultimate Spider-Man, I will still hold that's, like, the best uh, Spider-Man voice actor. Josh Keaton voicing Ultimate Spider-Man. He's so yeah. good. Yeah, definitely. Uh, the weakest thing we both agree is Noir, probably. Yeah, Noir can fucking eat rocks. He sucks. I don't ever want to play him again. He's awful. Yeah, I might, I Wait, might say I... are they like friends now? I guess. <laughs> it's fucked up. Yeah. yeah, I might prefer Noir still over Amazing, because... Noir is still something different, at least, and it does feel satisfying doing his takedowns. Whereas Amazing doesn't have anything special to it, and I hate that everything is looks so, like, gray, tan. Yeah, that's fair. That oh, after credits? <laughs> Yo! great love it i love it i love it i'm glad they got him in here <laughs> why didn't i get to play a spider ham that would have been great i would have loved it that was like a new game plus thing you can play as him yeah it would have been it would have been a lot of fun like they have like different like the cut okay so the costumes are they just like alt colors or are they like legit other spider-men they're like they're like legit actual different costumes. Okay, that's cool at least. Yeah, I mean, most of the alts, even though you are specific to the different Spider-Man version, most of them are based on one's Amazing Spider-Man War. Because mm -hmm. the others don't have as much to work off. <laughs> Fair. Yo, Dave Wittenberg is in here. I love Dave Wittenberg. Dave Wittenberg. Uh, he voices... He, oh, he voiced uh, Teddy in the original Persona 4. But after the PS2 game, they changed it to Sam Regal. Oh, okay. Wait, was there, like, yeah. licensed music? Uh, I didn't think so. Which all it's all just, like, the different names of the songs in the game, I thought. There are, like, six songs in this entire game, then? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe they sampled, maybe they sampled songs. Oh yeah, could maybe. Music. Yeah, it could be that. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, I love that all the different Spider-Man are the uh, voice actors from cartoons. Mm -hmm. They all do a great job. I think the voice acting as a whole is pretty good. Yeah. Um, there were, like I said, there were a couple like groaner jokes, but overall it was a good it was good yeah so. like these are all professionals here for this yeah. random Activision published game <laughs> and i do appreciate they got what's his nuts from the 60s show that's actually really cool dan phil was it i think yeah yeah is he still alive is he like kicking still like what's up uh, let me check real quick because if he's still around, I would love him to make an appearance in something else, too. Yeah. <laughs> Shoutouts to Barry Poon <laughs> for having... For being made fun of way too much. Sorry, dude. Um, yeah, it seems like he, it looks like he's still alive. Hell yeah. 71. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hell yeah. Oh no, apparently he was firing in the 81 series. It was in the 60s. I got that oh. One. As well as in Spider-Man and his amazing friends. Oh god, that fucking show. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, 
I, I've seen bits and pieces of it, but like it is not good. <laughs> no. It is not a great show. I'm gonna be real. The only thing I know about it is that he's teamed up with Ice Man and Firestar, who's an original character. Yep. I don't know why they don't just use Human Torch, but I have to imagine that was some legal stuff. Uh, it was probably they wanted like a girl on the team, but they also like wanted the firepower to to balance Iceman, I guess. I guess. I I don't know. I'm just really? I'm just spitballing. I have yeah. no fucking idea. <laughs> That's fine. Shout out to Laura Coco having a delicious last <laughs> name. <laughs> <laughs> also, the music in this game at points is surprisingly good. Yeah, there were a couple of good tracks every now and then. It it does get a little repetitive, though, I'm not going to lie. Yeah. But you enjoy the game overall? Yes, overall I enjoy it. I'd give it like a 6.5 out of 10. I don't like number ratings, but like to get... that, Like, it's above average, but like it's not, like, great, you know? Yeah. If you're a Spider-Man fan, then like it's probably an 8 or a 9. But as like a pat like a passive Spider Man fan, like it was it was alright. Yeah, I'm not I'm like not upset seven, I played seven. it. <laughs> yeah. I probably feel like seven or seven point five or something like that. Because I, I love all the weeks and nods of references and like keeping to the actual common continuity for stuff and using the cartoon voice actors and all these little like attention details. I show that they really care about the source. Oh, yeah. You can tell there is definitely a lot of love in it. Yeah. So, would you want to play the sequel? Uh, no. <laughs> no, no offense. I'm, I'm, I think I'm good. I'll, uh, the only sequel I'm probably gonna play is Spider Man on PS5. <laughs> <laughs> That's fair. Because. <laughs> I like that game too, but it's probably even more repetitive because they cut down on two of the dimensions. It's just amazing in 2099. Um, oh, then I definitely it, don't want to if they got rid of Ultimate. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's all about time travel. Gotcha. Um, time travel shenanigans. Um, but the basic gameplay of how you like the movement and the combat is very similar to this game. Uh. So. Gotcha. Not to mention, the entire game takes place in one building. <laughs> oh. <laughs> they Did they kind of cheap out on that one then? or? <laughs> I mean, they, they, they apparently they had a year to make the game. Oh, Jesus. They had to cheap out then. They didn't have a choice. Yeah. <laughs> it's also why they didn't call it Shard Regions 2. Because <laughs> then there would be expectations. Yeah, that's true. I do still enjoy the game though, because it has a bigger focus on story and a really weird story. Um, mm -hmm. Like the premise starts out as uh, Twenty Nine has to go back in time to stop Peter from dying, being killed, mm -hmm. and then worrying about all these like the ultimate dimension, alternate timeline shenanigans, and fixing the future. And you find out towards the end that the uh, the CEO of Alchemax in 29 is an older Peter Parker that's arranged. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. And what I love about the game and what helps it, despite the part of the gameplay, is that you're getting like constant back and forth between Peter and Miguel. And like constantly talking to each other and like over the course of the game are gonna trust you trust each other and see each other's friends. Aw, that's cool. Yeah. Wait, Rich Tom? Where's poor Tom? <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right, I'll be here all night, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, it's it, like not not to not to shit on the sequel. I'm sure the sequel's fine for what it is, but like I had my I had my fill of Spider-Man beat him up, you know, in this game. So Yeah, that's fair. I might end up playing Spider-Man 2 at some point, though. Uh, the Raimi Spider-Man 2. Because I actually enjoy that game quite a bit. Yeah. As jank as it is. 
<laughs> yeah, I, I used to like it. I just don't feel like it's Asian. <laughs> yeah, it's certainly mm-hmm. rough to go back to. The movement sometimes feels really stiff. Um, I remember in the, in the combat. Um, like, for some reason, you can't run straight up walls in that game. You, like, at some point, will on like a curve one way. Um, a lot of, like, weird choices with it. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, it's it's still a good game. Just yeah. jank, really jank. Yeah, yeah. I feel um, that. There is like an actual like more proper like beat 'em up Spider-Man game in the same generation called uh, Spider-Man Friend or Foe. Mm. Um, which is I think cool. I had I think I had the PS2 version of that, which is like a platformer. Kind of. Uh, first player plays as Spider-Man, and the second player can play as a bunch of other characters when you're going through levels. Oh, nice. Uh, Alright guys, we couldn't have sped this up. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm checking my watch now. I, I'm kind of... <laughs> what's, uh, what's going on here? I'm waiting yeah. for my doctor's appointment now. What's up? <laughs> I would love to see like another take any Spider-Verse type game. Like not yeah. specifically based on Spider-Verse itself but this kind of concept. Yeah. It it would be cool if like the Insomniac games eventually did dip their hand into that kind of thing. Yeah. Oh. Like Kevin Feige. Oh, oh wow. I mean granted it's special thanks so it's you know, not a huge thing, but like he's here. Yeah. Yeah, I would love Insomniac. Like you've actually made like a twenty ninety nine game or a noir game, <laughs> stuff like that. Yeah, that'd be cool. Well, that's the game. Hell yeah, that was a good time. I and I gotta say. Carnage was a really cool surprise. I was not ex- I was legitimately not expecting Carnage to show up. How come? I don't know. Like in my head, I see Carnage as like a Venom thing, and like I I know it's all Spider Man, but like in my head, Carnage is associated with Venom. Like is that because of the movie? Uh, no, not no. Like in general, like I've always seen them as like a thing together. Like, in not, like, I don't know. I don't have to explain myself. Fuck you. <laughs> That's I, fair. I just didn't expect Carnage, and I'm glad he's here. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> what kind of bonuses did I get? I hope the game crashes. <laughs> I think, like, Deadpool and Juggernaut are the bigger surprises, because they're legit not Spider-Man ven- uh, villains. Uh, Deadpool was also a big one. I just wasn't expecting Carnage at all, which was cool. Mm-hmm. So concept art it's all stuff you unlock just from being the levels <laughs> this art <laughs> this specific piece is not high definition <laughs> like is it <laughs> I got that one <laughs> this, this is like <laughs> this is someone's twitter profile picture <laughs> yo he's got like a burger it's so good why are his feet so small that's weird. He's got little tiny tootsies. What are, what's going on there? <laughs> oh, the, this is actually really funny. I like this. Wait, what does it say? Oh my god, look at the third guy. The guy, the medium guy. Deepool, yeah. you're my dad. <laughs> oh my god. What a fucking creep. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, they went ham on like the the Deadpool like art oh yeah yo these are so cool looking yeah some of this art is really good <laughs> yeah some of this art's really great i love it uh, then you get some of these where it's like it's kind of crusty looking like because it's just rendered really <laughs> like not at a high resolution <laughs> yeah and then <laughs> did they did did they just take the one picture of New York and then put different Spider-Man on top of it? I guess so. It, well, it kind of, it's kind of like the, the menu screen. 
Oh, that's true. Yeah. Wait, go back to that one. There was dialogue. Uh. Where did this idiot go? I can't believe I'm playing this game. Okay. That's kind of neat. Yeah. <laughs> Not very menacing in this. He's just like. Eh. <laughs> now that's a cool shot. Yeah. Look at my crotch. Look at my zebra print belt. He. <laughs> this is also someone's Twitter profile picture. <laughs> Oh god, the f fucking Sandman level sucked ass. And your fucking cornrow hair sucks too. He, he, he goes to the same barber as the Osborns. 48. Christian. Father of three. <laughs> <laughs> you can't tell me I'm wrong. Like... <laughs> <laughs> that, that's exactly what the fucking bio would say. Okay, this one they actually did something kind of cool, so that's cool. Well, because Amazing also are like very nearly the same universe. <laughs> Why are his feet so small? Who's drawing these tiny feet? I don't know. Oh, oh that, that cool. that'd be that. Would, you know, would be dope. Okay, so if. The, the cutscenes they have in this game are, like, the, the models posed, and then they, like, squash and stretch them as they need it, right? Yeah. Uh, if you want to look it up on YouTube, like, mute it so it doesn't make sound. But if you look up the cutscenes from Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker, this is the kind of shit they had in that game. Like, all the cutscenes oh. look like this. And it was really yeah, cool. Yeah. Yo. The concept art's better than the fucking gameplay is. Jesus. <laughs> what the shit is this? God, Vulture is creepy. <laughs> Vulture sucks, dude. Oh, no high Hachi door. Oh, wait. Oh, they are high Hachi doors. Look, you can see their hair. <laughs> well, and they have question marks like they're, like they're the Riddler. Oh, that's true. Uh, Thank God. God. So he goes to the same barber as Sandman. Yeah, he, they, they share a fucking stylist, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Um, and then. <laughs> okay, this is not a very like high res picture. <laughs> You know what this reminds me of? This is like that Spongebob caveman, like, pose. Like, the meme. You know what one I'm talking about? Uh, not a fan. Where he... Here, I'll try and... I'll, hopefully this doesn't crash. Okay. <laughs> Spongebob caveman meme. Okay, I'll... <laughs> I'm gonna send it to you and you're gonna be like oh that one like it's literally the same energy oh Jess <laughs> oh no I think internet cut out for her yep she's gone oh well I'll just Take time to appreciate the art. Hey, welcome back. Oh. What my happened? Internet suddenly, with the uh, my internet suddenly went out went, went out on my laptop. Oh, I'm sorry, babe. Thank you. Okay, I'm gonna stream up. Uh, so you know that SpongeBob caveman meme? Yeah, I got it. <laughs> yeah, that that like here. I'll go back to Goblin. Hang on. Save energy. 
Yep. Great. <laughs> All right, and then other. Oh, are these like different Spider Men? So comics. This is one of the. I think there was like DLC, a, a DLC outfit, and this is one of them, like cosmic Spider Man outfit for each of them. Oh, neat. Yeah. I don't. I don't really like the amazing suit. I just hate that his mouth is normal colored. Yeah, I don't like that one. I like the ultimate one. I love being black. Yeah. What are you trying to say? <laughs> I like black. Yo, Mysterio. The tablet. Oh, that's it. Okay, that's it for other, I guess. <laughs> All right. Oh, and then they have the bios, but... Yeah. How long are these bios? Oh, wow. They Yeah, they give you fucking info. Cool. All right, well... I guess that's and it then. Were, if you played on hard difficulty for levels, you unlock figurines. Oh, nice. That's everything then. Yeah, for sure. All right, we're gonna call it there then. Thanks for joining me, sweetie, and thank you for sharing this game with me. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Even though, even if there was a lot of jank and bumps along the way. <laughs> yeah, that, that's bound to happen with licensed games, though. So no problem. Yeah.